if you're wondering about the Twitter feed of Darla Shine, wife of Bill Shine, the former Fox News executive who just became a top aide to Donald Trump, think, what would Sean Hannity, Donald Trump and Roger Rails tweet if they thought only their white pals would be reading? Mrs. Shine deleted her Twitter feed Thursday just as hubby Bill formally became Trump's deputy chief of staff for communications. Unfortunately for her, Mediate's Kayla B. Karma got screen grabs first. Shine's feed is a stream of white resentment and racial animosity of just the sort you might see on Fox News, only without any filter for television. Some examples. The new stand-in president at hashtag Mizzou is black, she wrote in another tweet from 2015, Will every white college president have to be replaced? You really are a terrible president at Barack Obama at POTUS allowing our police officers to be gunned down like this. Comical to see these overpaid black sports stars give Black Lives Matter speech at ESPYs, tweeted Shine in 2016. White chicks can't perm their hair. Black chicks can't go blonde. Funny how critics calling to ban Gone with the Wind, Jefferson Memorial, but no talk of banning the N-word or rap songs with N-word in it. What do you think is the likelihood that husband Bill does not share Darla's views? I say the odds are slim and none. HuffPost reported that Darla Shine also went after the credibility of Fox News hosts Megyn Kelly and Gretchen Carlson, each of whom claimed they had been sexually harassed at Fox. Although Bill Shine has never been accused of harassment, he was pushed out over his enabling of it. Oh, and there's a Russian connection, too. From HuffPost, in November 2016, Darla, Shine tweeted an article from a blog that frequently promotes conspiracy theories and tagged Trump in it. The tweet read, Putin says Western civilization being destroyed by over-vaccinating that real Donald Trump hashtag too many vaccines. The headline of the blog post Shine linked to read, Russian President Vladimir Putin says that Western governments are enslaving humanity through vaccines. In other words, there's every reason to believe Darla Shine will fit in perfectly with the Trump administration. Twitter image via screen grab, 